Oh no! Do you see these stains? No, no, not my favorite shirt. Another day, another. Happy Sunday! I have some very fun things planned for the December podcast episode. Kind of want to aim to do like four episodes, like just go all out. You know how people do vlogmas? Maybe we could do podcast -mas. We have like three outfits planned, which I'm excited to show you. It's Sunday, so the post office is closed, but tomorrow on Monday, I'm gonna go pick up the outfits and I can't wait to like share them with you. I think you guys are gonna like them. Remember when YouTubers used to show off their empties? This is my newest one, which I've since repurchased. It's the Aveeno Daily Moisturizing Body Oil Mist. It smells so good. Oh my god. Another empty I have is this First Aid Beauty KP Bump Eraser Body Scrub. So this is the second time I bought it. The first time I bought it, it was a mini. And personally, I haven't seen any difference in my arms. I still very much do have strawberry skin but i thought maybe i need to try it for a longer period of time more consistently so i bought the big version it does make my skin feel softer but i think it's just because it's a scrub now i'm gonna get to cleaning of course throwing out the empties my new favorite lip balm grape flavored i want to open my window I'm finally gonna go get an eyebrow pencil. Where's my phone? I found it. I only have three songs on my playlist right now. For this car ride, we're gonna play my Everything and Anything playlist. I'll share with you the first song because there's like 500 songs. Hush by Miss A. I don't want that. Money by Lisa. Always a classic. <laughs> I was gonna get the next one, but this one was half the price of the next one. I got some new goodies. This is my new favorite lip balm. It's a great flavor. I decided to pick up strawberry and honeydew. So honeydew really smells like as you would expect, like honeydew. But the strawberry one is more like, it's more like sugary, I would say. More like strawberry cheesecake rather than strawberry. But I also got a new eyebrow pencil, so let's try it out. I got it in allegedly the color taupe. The e.l.f. section at Shoppers or anywhere, Walmart Shoppers is always such a mess. So it was in the taupe section, but there's no way to know if it's actually taupe. And I'm looking everywhere and it doesn't say anywhere what the color actually is. Hmm. So I'm hoping it's taupe. It's so tiny. I mean, does that look like taupe to you? Let's do a little... It seems fine to me. Here's the final look. And then my final touch. We'll see ya. If you're Audrey, skip to this timestamp. If you're not Audrey, then please continue watching. I have some damage control to do <laughs> because the other day or like last week, two weeks ago, I went to Lush to get Audrey like a gift. Anybody here does these a little I would like you to stop barking at me. Thanks for that. <laughs> I don't need it from both of you. So I thought it would be. So I thought it would be. <laughs> so I thought it would. So I thought. So I thought it would be special to get her some bath bombs. So what does she message the group chat today? She's, she asks, does Lush sell online? Immediately, no. Immediately, I said no. Obviously, they do. I've literally ordered from Lush online before. Here, let me hold you. So I have like this whole lie surrounding it. And like, I, I had a thought the other day. I'm like, what if she goes to Lush and gets it herself? 
I'm like, how do I, how do I stop that? Like I literally went into the Lush store and I made like a cute little basket. I picked out the cloth that everything would be wrapped in. So I'm like, so how do I stop this from happening? I'm like, I hope Girly doesn't fact check that Lush actually does sell online. They have been for a really long time. I almost made up like a whole story, but I wanted to like distract from the thing. So like I tried to distract from the conversation. So that's what I've been up to really just lying left right and center so audrey doesn't try to order anything from lush because i got you some I, got you. I am so annoyed with you right now i don't know why you keep barking at me it feels a little targeted so i think next time she comes down i literally i this is how i derailed the conversation i was like we'll go to lush next time you come down because she doesn't have lush where she is like we'll go together like so that's how i distracted from it <laughs> Because I don't want her to go because I feel like she'd pick the ones that I picked for her. Which, you know, in and of itself, they're bath bombs. I'm sure you'd get use out of it, but then my gift immediately feels less special. So I'm going to give her her Christmas gift early. I don't care. And that's going to be that. There we go. Is that okay with you, Mr. Kevin? You have enough attention, Mr. Kevin? Look at him. As long as he's being held, he's fine. Otherwise, it's just a big old baby. So that's my story. Again, I don't know. I put powder on my face and I still look very dewy. I guess the foundation is just inherently dewy. <sighs> but I'm trying to go for a more mattified look because when I'm filming, I notice it's like, oh, do you see right there? Why is it so shiny right there? And I put so much powder too because it just looks weird. I don't need that to be highlighted. I don't know. Also, Mr. Kevin, he keeps running into the neighbor's yard. So now, look at this, your cute little Barbie harness. He's losing his his privileges. <laughs> He's losing his privileges to be loose. Not that the neighbor cares, but you're too stupid for that. How do I get my dog to stop barking at me? Cause it's really annoying. I hope you can hear that and understand that. It's actually snowing outside and really cold. So let's go check it out. Let's go check it out, guys. Oh, good girl. Did you hear that? She's, oh my goodness, good girl. Good girl. Not your style, Kevin, is it? So yesterday I was downstairs and I got an email saying, welcome back to Netflix. I'm like, um, what? So I texted my mom, like, did you renew our Netflix? And she's like, no, but the dog stepped on the remote and it <laughs> renewed the Netflix. So I mean, might as well watch something. I could have just kept the braids in. So I just put something random on in the background and I chose all the darkness, no, all the light we cannot see. When I was playing Animal Crossing, I just wanted like to hear something, but it ended up being super interesting. Also, my chin has been clearing up. It doesn't look very clear, but it's feeling smoother. I ended up staying up pretty late and I finished the whole thing. Mind you, I kind of half watched the majority of it because I was playing Animal Crossing, but it was still interesting. We're going with honeydew today. See ya. I'm cooking right now, but I don't have any onions, so I'm gonna go get some missing ingredients. Oh, and my can opener is just not can opening. And he literally just <coughs> and he literally just snorted chicken base. I dropped some and it's gone. What the hell? Yeah, you better be sneezing. Someone's doing. To continue what I wanted to say outside, so basically, they're gonna come and harass me when it look, oh. <laughs> um, after editing and like making a new logo and everything, I asked right now on my channel if you guys preferred the old logo or the new logo, and everyone likes the damn old logo. Cause honestly, I just wasn't feeling it, that's why I asked. And um, I'm just gonna go back to the old logo. I bring all the drama, ma, ma, ma. I bring drama, ma, ma, ma. <laughs> you ruin everything. Can I just enjoy a song? Does it have to be this dramatic? I had the worst night last night. Basically, I just had really bad cramps. 
I was just like in bed crying with like a heated blanket, a TENS machine on my <laughs> stomach. So much Advil. Nothing works in that situation and I don't know what to do anymore. I feel really rough today, but we have some groceries to do. And I'd really like to get some bubble tea. I just want some milk tea or something like that. Squirrel. Okay, so I went to Farm Boy to try their salad bar. So this is what I got. A little bit of everything. Time to go thrift shopping. Fries before guys. <laughs> what is it? A bag? Looks like a bag. <gasps> you signed it? For real, for real? Well, somebody did. Black pink in your area. What in the world? I got some cute little hoop earrings. Come on, Misha. Come on, Misha. You see my makeup right now? In what world is that acceptable? Don't look at that. So I actually went to Winners yesterday and look what I got. A Hello Kitty mirror. So this is a mirror that I got so long ago. Do you see? It's broken and oh. Interesting. Um, there's no batteries in it either. I got it from Ikea. I've been looking at this one online and I was like, oh, but it's like so expensive and it's like half the price at Winners, kind of. I thought it's time for a little upgrade here. I've had that. My ex got me that like years ago. <laughs> and I want this one now. That is so tiny. <laughs> we'll see. Oh, that's, I think it's fine. I think it's com comparable. No, that's cute. I like it. <gasps> wow. I like it. Kind of the same size, but you have to take into consideration the Miss Kitty. You know, her bow kind of gets in the way, but it's fine. I think it's so cute. You can take it up as well because it comes with a stand. So here's a little stand here. <gasps> and it's magnetic. Oh my God. No, that's cute. Adjustable. That is so low though. It's doable. <gasps> Holy crap. Oh my God. My makeup looks so bad. Oh my god. This is actually scary. This looks disgusting. Like, this is actually disgusting. Say hi to the dogs. Hello. Does anyone remember Boys Over Flowers? Look how badly it's filmed too. Like, the quality. I bought some Rogaine the other day. I bought this a while ago, but I've only gotten around to using it more now. So I bought this yesterday. I've just been noticing. Do you see? Do you see? Anyways. I went to a hairdresser once and she's like, if you keep parting your hair, like specifically there, you're gonna go bald. And I was like, Okay, liar, that's not true. Um, <laughs> and uh, anyways, I've just been not loving my hairline. Like it used to look so much better. My hair has been a lot thinner. So we're just gonna try it. You know, this is not us. It says, if this is not you, don't use it. <sighs> I can do what I want in this world, okay? The thing with Rogaine is, you see it's as if it's like abnormal hair loss which it's off to the side. We're gonna try it. What do we have to lose? Don't use it if you are allergic to minoxidil. How would I know unless I try minoxidil? If you do not know the reason for your hair loss. Uh, I'm reading, I'm just reading, I'm reading. Oh shit. Before using Rogaine, talk to your pharmacist or doctor if you're taking or have taken recently prescribed, prescribed, prescribed. <gasps> Tretinoin. I'm on tretinoin! Oh, the following medication may increase the absorption of minoxidil. So it should be fine, right? I'll just grow more hair? I should Google this. So I'm looking up the use of tretinoin and minoxidil, and it says it's actually good. 
Um, I trust the first few Google searches, so we're gonna go for it. I'm crying though because of that eye cream. Thoroughly wash your hands. Let's stir this. So it says to use half a cap. We're gonna do, do I shake it? So I'll put it upside down. Oh. I'm just gonna use about that much. Because don't put on your hair, put it on your scalp, but like, I'm trying, okay, I'm trying. She's getting on the hair a little bit though. Oh, now I'm nervous, what if I created like a new hairline that I don't want though, do you know what I mean? Okay. There we go. There we go. Let's see uh, how that works out. Wash your hands after too, okay. 